Kevin Paprat. Welcome to the show. I'm so excited to talk to you. Kennedy, I am so happy to be here. Thank you so much for having me. I know you know California, and you know it's obvious what we've got. We've got a big old problem. So many problems. But here, here's what I like, Kevin. Um, I like the idea of Caitlyn Jenner because she listed Gavin Newsom's greatest vulnerabilities, which he has not tackled head on. Uh, these problems have only compounded, mm -hmm. and it's not just the pandemic. It's homelessness, it's transportation, it's housing, mm -hmm. it's schools. You have... A, a distinct, detailed plan for everything, and I want to touch on a couple things. Uh, one, I love this idea of future school. Uh, you were obviously a, a, an unorthodox thinker. You want to combine uh, high school, college, trade school, and financial planning school all in one place and let people 14 and over choose. Tell me about that. That's great. Absolutely. I mean, you nailed it here. I mean, everybody can point out the problems with California. There's no shortage of that. Housing, homelessness, schooling, transportation, you named it. The thing is, we have to solve California with a completely new way of thinking about it. And that's why on day one, I would declare four states of emergency, housing, homelessness, schooling, transportation, because you can't solve homelessness when people aren't educated. You need people to be able to get a job, be able to actually get a job that pays a living wage because of the skills and and value those people provide to businesses, and then they are not going to be dependent on the state of California. 33% of Californians are on Medi-Cal because they're so close to the poverty line. It's not their fault, it's Newsom's fault because the state doesn't educate people. We've got to give people the tools to learn and earn dignity. Well, you and, and, I, you and I both does. went to UCLA, which is the greatest public institution in these United States. Go Bruins. Uh, Go Bruins. Yes, absolutely. Uh, I like that. I like what you're saying about schools. I think we need more school choice. I don't think the, the state is the mm. best at providing education. Uh, but I do like that you want to, in terms of homelessness, build 500,000 units, not 80,000, over the next five years, and fast track permits, even for remodels, to which I say, yes, meet Kevin. Look, here's the thing. The California government is in the way of everything. I was talking yes. to a business today. They are losing workers to Arizona because it's easier and cheaper for people to leave where they're working in California. And I'm talking blue collar workers. I'm not talking Elon Musk, Joe Rogan. I'm talking people working $35, $40 an hour. They go to Idaho. They can buy a house. They go to Arizona. They can buy a house. They can start a business. They can have a job. And by they the way, and the they follow one of your other rules. There. They follow one of your other rules, it, which is go to a state that doesn't have income taxes. And then you can. And Absolutely. take that money you're saving and create your own wealth, which is what people in California want to do. You know, the optimists that are still there, bless their hearts. But if you're in a two bedroom apartment, you look at Arizona, you could be in a, a four bedroom house with a pool. It's a pretty easy choice for a lot of people to make. That's why California is losing people. Uh, they have gambled on it. And that brings me to another point of yours, which I absolutely love. Why should we drive or fly all the way to Vegas? Bingo. We need to build casinos throughout California. We have some of the most beautiful locations that need extra tax revenue as well so that we can build and develop our communities and have more affordable housing in many different areas. I'm not just talking about building casinos in Los Angeles or in Santa Monica. I'm talking about even building brand new developments. Get the government out of the way. Let yes. developers build. Let them do what they can do best. Put a casino in the middle of the town. Build a town around it, plan out more housing so people have affordable housing. We don't need rent control and subsidies. No, we need Santa Monica, more housing. Right. We need less government. Yeah, and you need you need more multifamily units. Stop with the single family dwellings. That's what has screwed everything up. Uh, I also love your idea to end high speed rail. It's never gonna happen in California. Sorry, California. Uh, I know Kennedy. everyone likes their choo choos, but stop. Go ahead. Kennedy, you nailed it. High speed rail cost this state th the equivalent of 3,000 Bitcoin. It's $125 million per mile. Elon Musk can build us safer, faster, and better tunnels for $10 million a mile. Why are we spending 12 and a half times? It's because people like Newsom don't know how to run a budget. They don't know how to spend money. They get money, go, oh, we got a budget surplus because we tax people too much, which one of my plans is removing taxes on the first $250,000 that people make Hallelujah. so people can come back to California. I've got people donating to me from Florida and Texas because they're like, please send the Californians back. But people are voting with their feet because yep. the state is broken. It's illogical the way this government is run. Well, I appreciate that, that you have come up with uh, a lot of logical plans here. There's more to dig into. I hope you come back on the show, Kevin. I would love to be back. Thank you okay. so much. Thank you.